Norman Foster's Life, Significant Projects, Theory, and Principle. Norman Foster, original name in full, is Norman Robert Foster. Born in June 1, 1935, Manchester, England. British architect known for his sleek modern buildings made of steel and glass. Foster was trained at the University of Manchester in 1956 to 1961 and in Yale University from 1961 to 1962 in New Haven, Connecticut. Beginning in 1963, he worked in partnership with Richard and Sue Rogers and his wife Wendy Foster in a firm called Team 4. In 1967, he established his own firm called Foster Associates, later Foss Plus Partners. Foster's earliest works explored the idea of a technology advance, shed meaning a structure surrounded by a lightweight shell or envelope. Foster's first buildings to receive international acclaim were the Sainsbury Center for the Visual Arts 1978 in Norwich, England, a vast airy glass and metal panel shed, and the Hong Kong and Shanghai Banking Corporation headquarters in 1986 in Hong Kong, a futuristic steel and glass office building with a strap profile. In these commissions, he established himself as one of the world's leaders in high-tech design for the latter building. For example, he had an indigenously moved element such as elevators to the exterior of the building, where they could be easily serviced and thus created open plans in the center of the spaces. Balancing out this high-tech character, many of Foster's buildings including his Hong Kong office and the Commerce Bank Tower in 1997 in Frankfurt and Maine, Germany utilized green spaces or mini atria that were designed to allow a maximum amount of natural light into the offices. In this way, Foster created a more fluid relationship between inside and outside spaces and to strove to impart a sense of humanity into an otherwise futuristic office environment. Foster, a veteran of the Royal Air Force in 1953-1955 and an avid pilot, also applied his preference for open plants and natural lightings to airports such as Stansted in 1991, outside London, and Czech Lapkok in 1998 in Hong Kong, and to the expressively simple American Air Museum in 1997 at Duxford, England Airfield. At the turn of the 21st century, Foster extended his ideas to world landmarks. He rebuilt the Reichstag in 1999 in Berlin after the reunification of Germany, adding a new steel and glass dome that surrounds a spiral observation platform. And he encased the court of the British Museum in 2000 in London, under a steel and glass roof, creating an enclosed urban square within this famous museum building. Foster's noteworthy buildings of the 21st century included the headquarters for Swiss Re, later 30 St. Mary Axe and nicknamed the Gherkin in 2004. The courtyard enclosure for the Smithsonian Institution's Patent Office Building in 2007 in Washington, D.C. Terminal 3 of the Beijing Capital International Airport in 2008 and London City's Hall in 2002. His later work included the Art of the America's Wing at the Museum of Fine Arts in 2010, Boston, the Queen Aliyah International Airport in 2012, Amman, Jordan, Ciudad Casa de Gobierno in 2015, the master plan for the Norton Museum Art of 2019, West Palm Beach, Florida, and the Datong Art Museum in 2021, China. He also designed Apple Park in 2018, the headquarters of Apple Incorporation in Cupertino, California, as well as a number of the company's high-profile retail locations, including Michigan Avenue in 2017, Chicago, the Champs Ilysses in 2018, Paris, and Marina Bay Sands in 2020, Singapore. The recipient of numerous awards for his work including the Pritzker Prize in 1999, the Japan Arts Association Premium Imperial Prize for Architecture in 2002, and the Aga Khan Award 2007 for his design of the Petronas University of Technology in Malaysia. Foster was knighted in 1990 and was granted a life peerage in 1999. A Norman Foster definition of architecture includes a connection with the past, an expression of values, and the social agenda. A Norman Foster architect philosophy does not include the history of architecture being the history of the monarchy. His architectural synthesis principles include adaptive reuse, flexibility, and social values. 
the principle of revivalism is not embraced. A list of Foster's values includes adaptability, flexibility, ecology, environmental awareness, integration, regeneration, reuse, social responsiveness, and technology.